basically because I'm transferring uh, content from this here, the old uh, phone, to the new one. That's going to take a while. And all the information uh, found at uh, te uh, on any information from the text messages will not be revealed because people send text messages that are entitled to privacy. They do have a right to privacy. They do have a right to privacy. The old shit of them. So probably. Yeah, I forgot probably do more anyway, like transfer more put more shit on her, like say new wallpaper and download new apps for shit download apps for whatever and get this set up. Then I'm gonna put install this in there. Dream Pro. Does he want the right shit if I uh, have anything capable of filming 4K? So I'll probably move on to the next part of the video. What the fuck? The new phone has TikTok on it. <laughs> I say fuck him. Fuck him. Fuck TikTok. There's more shit I'm going to be getting rid of. Give it a TikTok, give it a few more. Which, which I don't use. Oh, the fuck that is, I might get rid of that too. So I might as well just keep going, might as well go through this more and uh, see there's more shit I could be gotten rid of. I think it's such a pain in the balls process trying to get this activated, but now it's activated. Figure go through this until I can get a comeback from them. But I don't know, it's pretty much like say smooth sailing now. Smooth sailing ahead. Now you can say I'm a... Uh, playing like say uh, applications on this phone. Yeah, I figure it's smooth sailing like I said. Got rid of some applications that were not even needed. And I have no use for. 
But right now it's pretty much like say it becomes smooth sailing. I just gotta do now is make some more changes to settings. Like, uh, well, I figure if I transfer, uh, finally play songs on this, and I'll just, uh, once I do that, I could just transfer uh, music onto here. And put some and put some sets of new wallpaper too for it. Once that's done, then I can then I'll install that memory card. Switch the phone off, put the memory card in, and some bitch will be smooth sailing afterwards. I mean, real smooth sailing. You can see now this uh, memory card is ready to be installed. Let me all check that for a second. Give me a second here. Now it's now it's going in there smoothly. Now this. Phone here can now film uh, 4K videos and shit. Supposed to have a capability of filming 4K, which I'm gonna find out. Oh yeah, put this case on here next. Once that's on there, this will be pretty much like say fully ready and everything. Figured download apps for it. That, that, that should be on here. That one on here. I'll go up to say, move some, put some shit on there. Some videos, some music and all that shit. So now it's like say, ready for the next phase. You can easily tell that, uh, like the final phase was Put this case here on it. Be with the card inserted. Hook this case to it. Nice case here. We can definitely say all the phases are complete. Figure all the uh, items that need to be put on there, like uh, documents, video, music, whatever, is already on there. So. This is pretty much now set up and uh, ready to go. All set up, all ready to go. Without any problems. And before I film this final part of the video. Imagine to say, test the uh, they say try to film a video, but I'll probably find out if it uh, if it did take. So, well, other than that, this camera's pretty much like now good for use anyway. And find out that this uh, new phone here runs on the uh, Verizon's network. Yeah, fade the old SIM card when I uh, first got a smartphone years five years ago. Over five years ago, like I said we're five and a half, like around five over five and a half years ago. The SIM card that came with that only ran on CDMA or GSM, which is like the type of shit that AT and T and I think T Mobile uses or Sprint. I don't think T Mobile. Well, I could be wrong, but AT and T primarily uses GSM. This one uses a CDMA type network, says LTV. And it's a network run through Verizon. I guess I just didn't realize <laughs> that uh, before I got this phone, like last year, parent company TriPhone decided to sell TriPhone to Verizon. Other than that, you can definitely say you got a video right here, so you can just definitely say it's it for now. There'll be more coy videos to come anyway, so. Stay tuned if you don't, you'll regret it. So, do stay tuned.